Wasser. DC Multiverse Gladiator Batman from Dark Knights Metal Not gonna lie this looks good and is my favorite for this year at least this early now let's open him up and see how metal he is we have Batman Gladiator out of the box. So this this guy does not disappoint. Uh, of course, if 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 your figure has a QC QC issues, you'll be pissed. But luckily, luckily we don't have any QC issues, and this guy has some surprises articulation uh, and yeah 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 really really like it uh, a nitpick if if only they made the cape soft goods and not pre post plastic in my opinion it would have been better but the pre post cape is made out of soft plastic so it's not it's not that bad, but what if I want to pose him in a neutral pose with no wind? So the cape, the pre pose cape, doesn't make any sense. Yeah. But it is what it is. This guy still does not disappoint. And right now, this early, this is in the running of the best figure of 2023. Now, for his accessories. Trading card. Same artwork that's on the box. Real name, Bruce Wayne. Trap on Mongols planet war world so that makes sense of course a dc stand sorry the camera is not focusing and his battle axe Wish gave him I wish they gave him a shield too. So the battle axe is made out of soft plastic. The handle is molded or painted in brown plastic with details. So this is made to look like wood with wraps. So either that's for holding the weapon together or it wouldn't slip on his hand and the blade is painted in silver plastic to made to make look so it would look like metal with a lot of engraving detail on the axe head wow now let's see the figure itself so this is batman let's see the face sculpt it has that goatee forgot what you call this i tried growing this when i was a teenager and it didn't didn't, didn't work out <laughs> so I'm looking at him, he doesn't really look like a gladiator to me. He looks like a knight, a dark knight. Yeah, so a lot of 
wear and tear on his armor. A lot of weathering details. Yeah. This tassels makes him look like a Roman legionnaire. Badass belt with his axe, two axe as an emblem. Texture detail on his pants, yeah. Texture detail too on the cape, pre post cape. It's molded to look like there's wind coming through. Yeah. I like it. I like it a lot. Now let's. So there's armor too here. So he has a chest plate. And there's another plate meal under that for extra protection. I guess when you're. On War World, added protection is a must. <laughs> but the Superman War World is just wearing a loincloth, so yeah. So his his bat logo emblem on his chest has a lot of battle damage. So he has a lot of. He has seen a lot of action there. Yeah. Now let's check his articulation. So head. Head has no. He can't look up. <laughs> he can look down that much and that does a lot. But he can move his head side to side. Now the shoulder armor, the shoulder pauldrons is glued at the bottom. So it can eat it can and it will give way. So you can do 90 degrees. Which is great. Unlike the Dark Detective Batman, which the armor, shoulder armor is glued on the top. It really hindered the articulation. So I like what they're doing with this easily. Also, functional butterfly joints. Not just not just being put there for the sake of being there functional butterfly joints bicep swivel double jointed elbows R Wrist rotation and you can see where yeah articulation is okay. His gauntlet has a lot of blades, so this bat shoulder armor, his gauntlet has a lot of blades. So if you come near him. Yeah, so upper body is in a ball joint. It'll give you a lot of tilt. That much crunch. 
dot match lean back you can do a tilt tilt rotation and hula hoop action <laughs> Waist is also on a ball joint. Give you the same range of motion. The tassels are made out of very soft plastic, so it will not hinder articulation. So he can move his legs out that much. He can move his leg forward. Let's see. He can move his legs forward that much. He can move back. Not at all. <laughs> One of the surprise, this figure has thigh swivel. Double, of course, double jointed knees. Feet rotation can move forward and back and toe joint. Bat knee pads. So I would guess this would be shin armor. Oh, he has a blade on his foot. So he can just kick. So this is armored boots. There's a blade here. There's a blade there. It's a blade on the back too so he's ready for action he can easily hold his battle axe no problem so i guess he he is ready to kick mongo's butt <laughs> yeah. Mongul, not mongoose, mongul. So yeah. I like this very very much. I hope I hope you enjoyed our video as much as we enjoyed making them. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. I am vengeance. I am tonight. I am Batman. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained?